Hello, lovely people. Hello, hello, hello. What a sunny day. What a sunny day. Summer has seemingly arrived. I've got the shorts out, I've got everything on, giving away my nationality like no tomorrow, looking very much like the Scotsman in 10 degrees in London. But this message is not about my clothing or the conditions. It is about tonight's game, Chelsea versus Manchester United in the FA Cup quarterfinals to be played at Stamford Bridge. The seven time winners against the 12 time winners. Uh, Chelsea fully fit, and I'm gutted about this, but United are going through, have an injury crisis up front. Ibrahimovic out, Rooney, Marshall, Rashford out, and I really think it's going to affect the game. Um, United, I think, would have a good chance if they're fully fit, with those long balls pinged into Ibra. Um, but now it's looking like Fellaini's going to have to start instead. I don't exactly know what United's tactics are going to be. But it's not going to be the free-flowing game that I was uh, expecting. I think United are going to have to go direct. Um, the only thing that they had on Chelsea was pace down the wings and uh, a possible liability against the high ball into the box from Chelsea. Um, but now they don't have either of those two weapons. Um, United are coming back from Russia on Thursday, whereas Chelsea have had a, night, a week off. I think it's going to be Chelsea's game. Um, a fully fit United would have caused Chelsea problems, but it doesn't look like that way any, anyway uh, anymore. Chelsea unbeaten in the last 11 games against United and have won 15 of their 16 league games at home under Conte. It's going to be a really tough ask for United. I'm expecting a 2-0 Chelsea, maybe 2-1 Chelsea, um, and Chelsea will join City, Spurs and Arsenal in the semi-finals of the FA Cup. What a lineup! what a tournament this has been, reignited some love for myself into the FA Cup this year. Uh, and what a, what a set of summit finals to have. Everyone tune in, it's on BBC One later, I think it'll be Dan Walker and the lads as usual, uh, and it's set to be an absolute cracker. Enjoy!